Catholic schools prepare every student to meet the challenges of their future by developing their mind, yes, but also their body and their soul and spirit. David Vitter. You know, one of the things I do like about a Catholic education is I'm a big believer in the Ten Commandments. I dig those. You know, what a great concept to live your life by. Um, you know, and, and our kids follow that. And we lead by example by following the Ten Commandments, which I learned in parochial school when I was a kid. So uh, uh, it makes me a better person and a better steward for my children. It's a great spirit among the children and openness, helpfulness to each other, the openness to prayer. Uh, wanting to come to Mass. Um, I love that we all get to go together with, to Mass. I really like how we go to Mass. Oh, I love that we get to go to church. We get to go to Mass every Wednesday. I love going to Mass. kind of like brings us back down if we're having like a rough day. And just enjoying the beautiful Catholic influences. It can just kind of center us and it kind of helps us to get through the week. It's wonderful and amazing to think that we're educating the future of our Catholic Church. All the students that we have here, they're going to be our Eucharistic ministers, our lectors, hopefully our future priests and nuns. And so everyone in this gym and the auditorium at Bishop High School, they're the future of our church and we're very proud. I feel really blessed to uh, be able to go to a Catholic school where I uh, learn a certain base of academics. Uh, I am given the tools uh, to go out in college next year with what I've been given. I know that I'm prepared and I know that I've really uh, have achieved my full potential in the academic realm and I'm really looking forward to going out uh, next year to college and really uh, testing myself and seeing where I lie uh, compared to others. Consistency I think is the big theme here. Consistency. Um, and reinforcement throughout the uh, entire system and process of education is very important. My favorite subject is math because we're, um, we're learning about multiplication tables. My favorite subject at school is math and science because I think there's much to learn about it and you can never stop at one point. Arts because I get to express my inner emotions with it. I like science because there's lots of cool activities that we do. Favorite subject right now is math because I think it has a lot of skills that are going to be with you wherever you go. Math. Because um, it, I'm really good at it and it's really fun. I like social studies because of our teacher, Mr. Leon. He's really interesting and I like the way he teaches us about history and our geography. I think the most important thing about uh, Catholic education is the values that it has instilled in me. Uh, it's really taught me the importance of uh, learning, not just uh, about educational things like math or English, but it's also taught me about the importance of my faith with God. I've chosen to teach at a Catholic school for various reasons, um, to name a few, just being able to spread the word of Jesus to so many children and being able to share my faith with so many children has been so important to me and to my family and it's just been a really amazing experience. Service is an important aspect of my Catholic school community because it allows me to expand my horizon based on how I view things around me. As you learn and grow, you develop yourself you know, intellectually, academically here in the actual school, but when they ask you to go out into the community and serve, you also develop another part of yourself, which is the social, the emotional part, and you're interacting with other people, and as you go out into the community, you try to look for different ways to help out, and you can use some of the stuff that you learn in school, out in the community. Some ways I show community service are by helping out um, with CCD. It's like a catechism class. I do community service by, since I do martial arts, I teach, mar I teach a lower rank belts than me for uh, like no charge, I guess. I just 
uh, help them out in any way that I can. I give back to my community by helping out with picking up trash and doing community service. One of the ways I show service is volunteering at the Boys and Girls Club at Carpinteria. I like to help young kids learn how to do difficult assignments and just help them learn. I help out when somebody falls down at school, I help them up. When somebody like is hurt, I take them to the office. When I came to Bishop, you know, I didn't know what to expect with service, but doing things like Project Santa and other things really um, helps you see a different side of life. You know, over at a Catholic school education, like here at St. Mayfield's, you know, we're building an overall student. I mean, it's just not grades, but let's face it, the grades here are great. The curriculum is good, they've got excellent teachers, and all the Catholic schools have good teachers, but they're making them good people. They're teaching them what's right, what's wrong, how to follow the rules, how to pay appropriately and kindly to each other. And you throw in there a great education you can't lose. It's a good way to go.